This video reviews one really, really important idea when solving Sintonis equations. And it's linked to the signs in the question. Now then, I've got two equations, one of the form y equals and another with x and y on the left-hand side. Now I can solve this through a process called substitution. So if I look at equation 2, I've got 5x take away 2 lots of y. But I know what y equals in terms of x. So I can replace this y here by 3x minus 1. So bracket y is the same as 3x minus 1. And this just equals 4. So I've subbed in the equation for y into the second equation. Now, with brackets, I know I must expand first of all. So I've got a 5x, but this bracket is times by a minus 2. So I must be really careful here. Minus 2 times 3x is minus 6x, but minus 2 times minus 1 is plus 2. And that's a really, really, really important thing not to forget. When we've got two negatives, it becomes positive. Right, I'll now simplify. 5x take away 6x is minus x, plus 2 is 4. I can take away 2 to the other side, so 4 take 2 is 2. So if minus x equals plus 2, then x just equals minus 2. <clears throat> so the value of x, which satisfies both equations, is minus 2. I then finish by finding y, but that's not difficult because I've got y equals in terms of x. So therefore, that tells me that y just equals 3 lots of minus 2, take away 1. 3 times minus 2 is minus 6, take away 1. y just equals minus 6, take 1, minus 7. So the two solutions, x equals minus 2 and y is minus 7, satisfy both of the equations.